Hello everyone and welcome back to another Outriders video. Today I'm going to show you how to get one of the best guns in the game in under one minute. Now there is some videos floating around on YouTube already uh, about what you have to do. You have to run the starter mission to get one of these guns, put it in your stash, delete the character and go again. I found a much quicker method. It takes you less than a minute to get a replacement gun. You can stack up a whole stack of them and then roll them all and hope for one that's going to give you over 90k firepower that's what i was aiming for something over 90k is pretty rare in the game and pretty hard to get i definitely think it's a really good target when we look at this gun this is one that's maxed out now at purple item level 50 it's got crit damage status power and long range damage unfortunately that status power isn't short range damage otherwise it would be as good as it could possibly be I'm definitely on the lookout for something like that but i think it's pretty damn rare it comes with bone shrapnel tier 2 actually better than the tier 3 mod maybe they've got them the wrong way around who knows but it's absolutely great for add clear and it's also got killing spree on now i put killing spree on because i think it's the best gun dps talent but then you can put on whatever it is you need in that second slot just to show you then how you're going to do this if you head over to your stash, when you've purchased the DLC or if you've already got it, you go into your inbox, you'll see you will have the gun here. Now it comes blue once you level it up to 50 it, and then up the rarity, it then adds a random second talent. We're not worried about that, we can replace that. But when you sh switch it from the standard variation to the burst variation, it gives you an absolute random firepower stat. And that's what we're concerned about. There's no way of undoing that once you've rolled it. We want to get something around 360 or higher. If you get 360, that's going to take you over 90k once you've leveled it up. Mine, I got 367. I think it took me to 93.7. So that's the kind of numbers you're going to be looking for. So what we'll do here, we'll take this one out of the stash. We're going to head over... To the expedition table we'll go into coliseum probably shouldn't have done coliseum because i have to pay to get in definitely do a free one going forward and all you need to do is go in fire a bullet at a bad guy and then die we're no running in we're gonna let them kill me Now that you're dead, you're going to click Abandon. And when you head over to your stash, what you'll notice is now is that you've got a padlock at the top. Return to Lobby. And then just click continue game. Head over to the stash. And collect your new AR. So really, really quick. Much quicker than creating a new character and running it over and over again. Now once you've filled your inventory up with these guns. And you've got as many as you can actually hold. Head over to Zahidi. And what you're hoping to do is when you click switch variant and you go to tactical, we're hoping for this number to be 360 or higher. That one's 305, so we're just going to escape back. We're going to go to the other one that I got. And that's 331. And that's definitely not what we're going to be looking for. We want much higher than that. Now, if your game happened to crash here at this point, and you got super unlucky, because let's face it, the game crashes a lot, you would have to do this process all over again with all the guns that you've got in your inventory. So once you've got one that you're happy with, we're going to use this one as an example, even though it's only 316, you actually want 360 and above to get over that 90k barrier. 
you're going to come out of here and you're going to level it up with whatever character you've got the most resources on. You can transfer these around in your stack. I'm going to take it all the way up to level 50. And this is going to be really low damage as you can see only 56k. It'll get a boost from improving the item there up to 60k. You can then choose a talent and then in that bottom slot you can roll whichever you want to go hand in hand with Bone Shrapnel Tier 2. Like I said previously though, what you were looking for is 1 over 360 and once you've improved it all, you'll end up with something like this at 93.4k. It won't take you too long because you can get that many rifles now, you can fill your inventory up really really quickly and just run through them all. But you're going to come across a little bit of a dilemma. Once you've filled your inventory with them, you're going to realise that they've got this padlock icon on the top left and you can't get rid of them. At this point you're going to have to put them all in your stash. You are going to have to create a new character, run through the intro mission at the beginning until you can access the stash, transfer them all over and then delete that character and that's going to be the only way you're going to be able to get rid of them and get them out of your stash. So that's it everybody a really quick video come and check me out over on twitch there's gonna be lots more outriders content coming this week i've finally got a couple of my builds perfected and to a place where i feel like it's good enough to start sharing them be sure to hit that subscribe button give this video a thumbs up because i've just saved you a whole bunch of time not having to run that intro mission over and over again come and check me out over on twitch twitch.tv slash dj tickle and say hi there Thank you for watching everybody, I'll throw some gameplay footage now at the end so sure you can see how hard this build hits with this 93k gun and I'll see you in the next one, goodbye. Coliseum.
Who the hell are you? The Ferals found a fall. Now they think I'm falling for this painfully obvious trap. <sighs> what a bunch of clowns. Creatures. That Ferals made me out. That's the last of the monsters. That maniac is not too happy. Here we go. Not a bad shot. Maybe he'll finally shut up now. The pot is ours.